Scenario planning enables portfolio managers to use a centralized platform for creating, managing, and comparing multiple scenarios of planning items. This helps them determine which scenario best fits their needs. To access scenario planning, select a portfolio plan from the strategic planning workspace. The portfolio plan's timeline, owner, and entities are listed under the title. Under the prioritization tab, portfolio plan items are listed in order of importance. This list also shows each item's planning state, type, and other customized details. This portfolio plan has new items that haven't been prioritized yet. You can create a new scenario to determine the impact the project's new priority may have on your portfolio plan. A new scenario pop-up will appear. Enter the scenario name, description, and where you're copying the scenario from. In this case, the scenario is copied from the current plan. The scenario planning page is now displayed in simulation mode. This means that any changes made will not affect the current life plan. Here, you can remove or add items to the plan. Items with prioritized or done states are included in the plan. Scenario dates are populated based on the actual, planned or approved dates of the live planning items, depending on their availability and order in the plan. If the scenario dates are outside of the portfolio plan's timeline, they are highlighted yellow and not included in the plan. You can also see how items are aligned with the primary goals of the plan and those that don't have a primary goal. Roadmap view shows each in-plan item's duration. Edit the duration of items in this view by extending, shortening, or moving them. You can also perform different actions depending on your needs, like creating, managing, and comparing scenarios, as well as viewing approved scenarios. The Manage Scenarios feature enables you to navigate to different scenarios, edit their name, and delete them. The Compare Scenarios feature makes it easy to compare scenarios with the original portfolio plan as well as other created scenarios. You can also view approved scenarios along with their approval date and approver. In this case, to compare scenarios, a new scenario will be created. The new scenario is now displayed and another item will be added to the plan. Now there are two scenarios that you can manage and compare. The Compare Scenarios page displays the current plan and the selected scenario next to each other. The current plan is shown as the default and you can see how the plan's strategic alignment and planning items compare to the new scenario by showing items that have been added or removed. You can add more scenarios to compare with the current plan. This will show all the created scenarios you can choose and compare. Now the two created scenarios appear next to the current plan. You can approve scenarios from the Compare Scenarios page or from an individual scenario page. When approving a scenario, the approved dates for all planning items selected as in plan will be overridden. Other planning items that were previously prioritized and have the in plan toggle turned off will be removed from the live roadmap. You can also add notes about why the scenario was approved and by whom. There is also the option to delete all other unapproved scenarios after approval. Now the scenario is approved and can be edited, managed, and compared again in the future. Scenario planning can help you prioritize, optimize, and manage demands, projects, or epics based on your team's or organization's needs. To learn more, see our product documentation or knowledge base, or ask a question in the ServiceNow community.